Hey guys, I just went out to go check on a bearded dragon that was having an issue and we think maybe for you make a good hole if you didn't. <clears throat> I have a story. Oh. See, in my days, we used to cut jazz, hang out, you know. Ah! Grab the fishing poles and head down to the creek. Florida. Jump in and wrestle a couple of gators. Perfect place but to that one Is that one or two? That's a two bad to be this beautiful older woman. We laughed. She took me uh, under. Still... And I never wanted to come back to the surface. My God, I'll tell you. But you see, in this thing that we call life, you may have people try to stop your greatness. But no one can stop you of your drive. Except for yourself. So here I am. Trying to achieve greatness. Well, gonna achieve greatness. Check me out. It's FLA Rocky. Don't you ever forget that. Now, boom. hey! Alright, you guys. I just went out to go check on a bearded dragon that was having an issue, and we think maybe furries laid some eggs, but gotta wait for Ken. When he gets here, we're gonna find out. Yeah, so I came in here, uh, well, Ken came in earlier and found an egg on the ground, and it had ants on it, so. He sprayed and then I was making up some pyrethrin just to spray and for sure I saw a lot of ant action so I, I quickly sprayed and as soon as Ken gets here we'll see if Furby has laid the mix. There's the in, infertile egg that was on the ground. I would say that she definitely looks skinnier. I think she looks definitely skinnier to me. Did you lay some eggs? You sure did lay, make a good hole if you didn't. Here's the hole. Pretty good hole. Can it be here in a minute? We'll find out. I might see eggs without even Ken's help. What do you guys think? Better spray. Just in case there's ants in there too. Ants are the number one problem we have as animal caretakers. I just called Ken's mom and said, tell Ken to come on because there's ants in the nest I think, but watch there be no even eggs. I mean, that's my luck. We'll find out. I'm pretty sure there's a nest of eggs. I could be wrong, but I think so. And I think there's ants in it. Mm, I don't know what I was recording. Oh, not if you put your hand like that, then I guess there wasn't. No, she made a... Oh, yeah, there is. I thought their ants looked like they were after something. Spray them. All right there. Spraying pyrethrin. There's a link in the description below if you want to know more about using it around your animals. So deep for a little lizard. You sure can dig a deep hole. What are you thinking right now? Head back in the cage now. So how many eggs did Fergie lay her first time ever laying eggs? Five? 
And some infertiles. One, two infertiles, and she had the one last week. Do you gotta put bearded dragon eggs in the incubator, or do we put them in like the hubivator thingy? The same temperature as tortoise eggs? I don't know, have you ever done bearded dragons before? Yeah. First time for everything. It's awful. Florida. Perfect place to have reptiles, worst place to have reptiles. Nasty egg. The smell is just atrocious. One bad egg out of all those, though you can't complain. Was that one or two? That's two bad eggs. Oh, oh it's still. Oh, uh, but they're hatching too. Oh my God, it smells. Luckily you found it. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Alright, that's uh, how we set the bearded dragon eggs up. I don't know, they might go bad, you never know. Obviously, eggs do go bad, but sometimes they don't. Hopefully all these don't. Alright y'all, it's the next morning. I thought we'd check on the eggs. We're going to incubate them at 85, which I think is maybe a degree or two higher than you might would look for. And let's see what they look like. Oh yeah. So they did, they plumped up overnight, they look nice and white and nice and healthy, not meaning that they're going to stay bad. You know those uh, eggs that went bad yesterday in here, those were yellow foot tortoise eggs and those just happen to be a little bit harder to hatch out than others, uh, but bearded dragon eggs are looking good. So we're going to be looking for uh, 84, 85 degree incubator temperature and about 60 days, maybe, they'll hatch. Thanks for watching this video. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. See you next time.